Social media marketing for small businesses is all about being strategic. With 4.2 billion active social media users, it's really important for small businesses to get online and reach their target audience. More on target audiences later. So in this video, we're going to explore the five essential reasons for using social media for small business and the best social media platforms for your business. So number one, obviously, is reach more customers. Social media has leveled the playing fields, giving businesses like yours a way to reach a wider audience and increasing your chances of attracting new customers. For that reason too, it increases brand awareness. So a well executed social media strategy leads to increased visibility for your business and the more your brand is shown online, the more familiar people will become with it. It also enables you to understand your customers better. Social media will help you learn more about your customers' interests, needs, behaviors, desires, and this valuable customer data can be used to improve your social media marketing strategies as well as what you give to your consumers. And number four, you'll understand your competitors better. And why does that matter? By taking a look at what your competitors are doing, you can learn what's working well for them and what isn't, and then use that information to make yours better. And finally, number five, this is the reason I love social media the most, that you will build long-term relationships with your customers. You will build community. Social media is all about building relationships. It's not about selling stuff. It's nurturing connections. And if you secure these relationships, that will increase your brand loyalty and your long-term chances of success. So if we go on to social media platforms, I'm gonna give you a basic rundown on each platform, and then through doing some more marketing work, you will figure out which platform is best for you. So Facebook, the most used social media platform globally still. It's a great platform for business because it has this wide demographic, it's easy to use, and it's now designed a lot for advertising. Not the best for community in my opinion. Instagram, best for visually driven businesses. It's got over a billion monthly active users and it's popular among the younger to middle age audience. Twitter, best for customer service or for people just wanting to have a rant. It's an interesting platform. It's worth reserving your handle on it. LinkedIn is great for B2B, so business to business platforms. It's a really good professional networking site. It's very helpful if you're selling something that professionals might find useful. Pinterest is a great platform for small business because it's a positive space, it's highly visual and you can reach new audiences that are searching for the thing you're selling without even knowing you exist. Who hasn't planned a wedding or a house renovation on Pinterest? And then finally, probably my favorite, certainly at the moment, is TikTok. It is a fabulous platform for small businesses and the number of people who just don't want to get on it blows my mind. It's a level playing field. It's all about creativity and there's a lot of opportunity for reality. Brands have been built on TikTok. But before using it, you need to ask yourself if you have time to create TikTok videos. If your target audience uses TikTok, it may not be who you think it is. And if you have creative ideas for those videos, but we can help you with that. Then we have YouTube. If you're already making videos, make them for YouTube. YouTube is a really good platform for business because you can drive traffic to your website, improve your SEO and build brand awareness because those videos come up in Google searches. But again, before using YouTube, ask yourself if you have the resources because it's really important to do one or two channels well, not all of the channels badly. The key with successful social media is consistency. So once you've found the right platform for your marketing, you've understood your target audience and where they hang out online, it's time to start posting. The best advice I can give you is to plan your content in advance by creating a social media content calendar, which I have a template for. Mix up your content, blog posts, so content marketing, images, infographics, videos, and stay consistent. Make sure to monitor your results and adjust your strategy as needed. So we will go through analytics in a future module. It's really important to have a look at what works and what doesn't and repeat one and not the other. Without question, social media is a valuable tool for small businesses. It helps you reach your target audience on a way that almost nothing else will. By finding the right platforms for your business, planning your content in advance, staying consistent, you will be well on your way to success. And we will go over much more of this in detail in future videos.